All right, y'all, in case y'all did not know, we have a solar eclipse happening April 8th, so make sure that y'all tune into this information. If you didn't know, there are three main types of eclipses, total, partial, and annular. This year, there will be a total eclipse, which means the sun is completely covered by the moon. Seeing that this is a total solar eclipse, the moon will completely cover the sun's surface, making a dark shadow appear on Earth. So make sure that everybody's being safe when looking at this cloud because this solar eclipse is rare and can only be seen from specific spots. So we're going to stay tuned for that too as well. Paraland is one of the locations in which you can see 90% of the totality of the eclipse. The start of the eclipse happens at 1221 when the moon bites the sun, where it, you see that the uh, shadow of the moon is slowly casting over the sun. At around 1250, the temperature will start to change. At 106, the brightness of the sky will slowly begin to turn dark. At around 123, the light levels and colors around you start to change and things will start turning darkish gray. At 132, the reaction of nature starts to take effect and plants and animals will be affected throughout this time. This is mostly seen in rural areas, so you probably won't see it around you, but it happens. And at 140 is the maximum eclipse. We talked a little bit earlier about the safety of viewing an eclipse, but in case you didn't know, we have eclipse viewing glasses for everyone to use, so make sure that you put them on. While viewing the eclipse, it's not safe to look directly into the sun because you could become partially blind. So make sure that when, whenever you're staring directly into the eclipse, you're wearing your eclipse glasses. They have a special shade that blocks off the radiation of the sun, allowing you to look directly at the sun. Once again, while viewing the eclipse, make sure you use the proper eye protection and avoid looking directly into the sun. Thank you everybody for tuning in. These are some quick tips to make sure that you stay safe on April 8th and not become blind. And not that's, become that's blind. That's how we're going to end it.